Everybody. Welcome to getting ready for fifth grade math like a boss. My name is Miss McCarthy and I'm here to teach you today to become a boss mode fifth grader. All right with math. I well, we are on week six if you're joining us today. Um, we've got an eight week we I don't know who we is it's just me here but we as a new all too have an eight week course that we've got going on here and this is week six day 26 and today we're going to be working on powers of 10 multiplying and dividing by powers of 10 it's going to be so awesome okay um and everything that i do here you can find in the workbook plus more by clicking the description box below there's a link if you wait until the end of the video i'll show you what i'm what to do by clicking it and uh yeah i'm done talking about uh, this stuff let's talk about math now and let me teach ya. Boss notes. All right, everybody. We are going to be multiplying and dividing by powers of 10. What are powers of 10? They're 10, the number 10, with little exponents. So if you see 10 to the second power, that would be 10 times 10, two tens. If you see 10 to the fifth power, that's 10 times 10 times 10 times 10 times 10. And 10 to the 4th power would be 10 times 10 times 10 times 10. So it just tells you how many times you multiply by 10. All right, but we've got some tricks, some mathematical things to help you build your, build your fluency with multiplying and dividing by powers of 10. So here I have 3 and 45 hundredths times 10 to the 2nd power. Okay, because I'm multiplying by a power of 10... I'm making this number bigger. So because of that, I'm going to take my decimal and shift it two places, because there's two tens, two places to the right. So one, two, that's where my new decimal goes. So it would be 345, and I could put a decimal, but I don't really need it. All right, for this one. We're doing times 10 to the fifth power, so I need five hops making this bigger because we are multiplying. So to the right, one, two, three, four, five. So that would look like this, and then I've got a zero here and a zero here. So that would be four, eight, seven, zero, zero, and then my decimal point would go there. So 48,007. All right, for dividing by powers of 10, we're not going to the right. We're actually going to be moving to the left, okay? So if we're dividing by powers of 10, we're going to go to the left, 1, 2, put our decimal, and put a 0 to hold that space. So it would be 0 0.0345. Okay? And then if we're dividing here, it's actually going to be really big. I'm going to rewrite this. Okay. So I divide it by, so I'm going to move five hops because I've got an exponent of five. One, two, three, four, five. Put my decimal and put zeros to hold these spaces. And I'm going to put one right before two. So zero point one, two, three, four, five zeros. One, two, three, four, five zeros, and then four, eight, seven. I know it's tiny, but that's how you do it, okay? Learn it section, everybody. All right, so we've got three, sorry, 34 and two tenths divided by 10. Now there is not an exponent here, but technically there is, okay? 10 by itself is just like 10 to the first power. And because we are dividing, we're gonna be going to the left and making this number smaller. So one place to the left, because we've got an exponent of one, put our decimal and rewrite it. Three and 42 hundredths. All right, number two, 
76 and 31 tenths times 10 to the third power. So we're going to do three hops. Now we need to go to the right and make this digit bigger because we're multiplying by the power of 10. So we're going to, I'm going to just rewrite it down here. We're going to go one, two, three, put your decimal, zero to hold the space, rewrite it. Okay, and we don't need the decimal because we don't have any numbers in the behind. So 76,310. And now let's go to the practice it section. Practice it. Okay, so this is number three. You may make a choice here. Do you want to go and do this on your own and then come back? Or do you want to just stick with me and help me out with it? Make your choice now. I'm going to rock and roll right now. So I've got 96 thousandths times 10 to the seventh power. So I'm multiplying. That means am I going to make this number bigger or smaller? I'm going to make it bigger if I'm multiplying. And I'm multiplying, so am I going to go to the right to make it bigger or to the left? Going to the right would actually make this number bigger, so we're going to go to the right. Um, and I'm going to go 7 jumps to the right into a new place value. So I'm going to start writing this down here. Let's make my 7 jumps to the right to make it bigger. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7 place my decimal. And what do I put in each of the spaces? Right, zeros. So to rewrite this number, I'm not going to write these two because they're just zeros and they have no value. So 96, 0, 0, 0, 0. And then a decimal point. I'll need that. 1, 2, 1s, 10s, 100s, comma. So 960 thousand is your answer. One more to go, everybody. Last one, number four. We've got 480,000 divided by 10 to the sixth power. I'm dividing, so am I making this number greater or smaller? I'm making it smaller. I'm dividing it down. And because of that, I'm going to take my imaginary decimal and go to the left. And how many jumps am I going to make to the left? Six, my exponent. One, two, three, oops, hang on, let me do that again. Ooh, messed up with my comma there. One, two, three, four, five, six. That's where my decimal goes. I'm going to put a zero right on to, in the ones place. So zero point four Eight, and I don't need all these zeros behind it, so 48 hundredths is your answer. Today's B message is to be innovative like a boss. Be someone who is creative, who tries to improve on something or create something new. Each and every one of you are creative in your own way, so go out there, take risks, don't be afraid to make mistakes, you're going to make mistakes, that's how we grow, that's how we learn. Uh, write down your ideas and be curious and explore this world and try to create something new from it. Be innovative like a boss. Get ready. Get